Be careful, it's a mess in here. And how are you? You're better, right? It's all clean. No need to freak out. It's all clean, Mooka Dees. Don't be upset. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Oh, look what you brought. I brought some oh, fruit. Thank you. Let me see. Oh, tangerines, oranges, bananas, apples. So many things here. Karen brought a lot of things. Why are you cheering so much, Rami? What's the big deal, huh? We shop too, you know. So what? Did you get some oranges to make Orange Crush? Mm -hmm. Good. We'll make Orange Crush for Fatma Gul. I'll also boil some fruit and add some clove, cinnamon, and honey. It'll do her good. Oh, yes. She'll be better in the morning. She's better now. Compared to this morning, she's better now. She had her injection and her medicine, so she's a little better. Uh, now we just have to hear her crying. So how was your day? Uh, I just worked. That's good, that's good. It would be better if you had a regular job. It's better than nothing, though. Uh, let me wash my hands, okay? Listen. That woman, what did she tell you? We just talked, never mind her. I really want to know, though. They're talking. Shh, shh. Let them talk. She came here for me. She manipulated Emre as well. Did he tell you all of this? <sighs> what about him? Does Mustafa know that I'm here in the house? He doesn't. She never told them that you two had met. Mustafa knows nothing, so don't be scared. Nobody scares me, Karam. You shouldn't be scared. He won't bother you. He has someone now. He won't be bothering you or me. Since we don't have any reason to be afraid, we can divorce. We can both move on. I won't divorce you. But you said we could get divorced. You promised me. I can't. But it's what I want. You can't divorce me unless I want to get a divorce. I'm not getting divorced. I won't leave you. If you let Mustafa and his family live in this house, you'll be doing that favor. Listen, you don't care about Karem at all. Well, of course, before all else, I'm trying to protect myself and you, Mother, but it'll be good for him, too. Me keeping Mustafa under control is in his best interest. Okay, but we can't be on pins and needles all the time, son. How can I sleep soundly at night? Please don't be like this. I did it. It's a done deal. Your uncle will be furious. He should have thought twice when he threatened me with Mustafa. He wanted to threaten me. I knew he was bluffing about it. But if you are on my side, he'll surely shut up about it, Mom. 
You're playing with fire. I know what I'm doing, Mom. I have Mustafa on a little string. Just trust me. Good morning. How can I help you? Um, a box of sugar cubes, ten eggs. Right away. And two packs of flour, please. Anything else? No. Oh, a newspaper. The wedding of the year. Do you need anything else? No. How much is it? 1,025 liras. Here you are. Thank Have you. Have a good day. Thank you. You sit down and have your breakfast, son. I'm in a rush, Dad. The boss. He's waiting for me. Why don't you eat a pancake? It'll make me happy. Is it ready? Mr. Erdogan's in a hurry. Here, take these to start. The rest will be ready in a minute. I'm off then. I should get the car ready, Mother. Don't work too hard. Take your medicine and drink lots of water. Don't worry about me, son. Go on. Have a great day. Goodbye, Dad. Goodbye, son. Come here. I'll give you a kiss once more. It's a special day. Come here. Happy birthday, mm. my son. No, mm. mother. Thank you so much. Uh, your present will be here in the evening. Please don't get me any presents. I'll keep quiet. Go on. Go to work. <sighs> oh. Hmm? She took out the syrup for the pancakes, but forgot to take it. Why are you running, dear? Well, the show has already begun. They have informed all the newspapers about the wedding. Oh, it smells so good. Mrs. Halide sure pampers me a lot. You forgot the syrup. Thank you for the pancakes. Bon appetit. The pancakes are yummy. If I don't stop myself, I'll weigh a thousand pounds. You're young, you'll burn it off. Oh, if only that were true, Mrs. Halide. <laughs> Look at him grumbling while eating. I'm glad you enjoy it. I'm happy that he likes my food. Mrs. Halide, uh, on the wedding day, there'll be quite a lot of guests attending. I think we might have to help them. After breakfast, I'll come down and we can talk about plans for the big day. All right, enjoy it. You're very pleased with them, admit it. Easy now. You'll choke, dear. I have to hurry. I'll be late for work. <laughs> <laughs> 